Okay, so three, two, one, yes. You must good YouTube. It's okay, what's up? from Foster Sports in 75. The whole of skinny niggas died to them. It's clear the clouds are too close to the ground. So we all trust this guy. I'm not alone. I'm out here with the most beautiful woman in the world. Sasha, okay, sushi from your boy, African United. And you're watching a brand new episode, the first episode of 2021 of cooking sushi with Foster. Today, we're gonna to be cooking a variation of one of my favorite meals of all time. Mm -hmm. You can ask my mom, call her right now. Bring, 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 my mother, Kyle. 07. Okay, <laughs> that's the. No, no. <laughs> call her right now. Bring, bring, my mother, Kyle. What is Wasabi's favorite meal every Sunday? You know, the mm -hmm. Fosterra staple, mm -hmm. as I like to call it. Mm -hmm. And she'll tell you right now, there's not many meals that I love. Yeah. Over the spaghetti, yeah. Yeah, tin fish, guys. That's my. You know, that's my Sunday meal. Right now, the, still working out on the Lobola money, mm -hmm. but as soon as, you know, the cows have been sent over to the Langa house, you know, that's what she needs to make sure that she knows that it's being eaten in the Mgoni household. Okay. When she's finally such a Mgoni, <laughs> when she's finally such a Mgoni, she needs to know Sunday spaghetti and pilches. So okay, I, hope I, I actually, right I really don't mind because it's something that's very easy to make and mm. very quick and it never goes wrong. So exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're going to be making what, Sasha? Um, what is this? Saucy fish meatballs and spaghetti. Basically, yeah. On this recipe, guys, anyway, we're going to be using mm -hmm. the the pilchards to make the actual meatballs. Meatballs. So they're basically fish balls. Basically, fish balls. So basically, guys, I'm going to write down the recipe and the ingredients list mm -hmm. in the description. So check that out mm -hmm. if you want to also do this mm -hmm. meal that we're going to be doing with my. Um, assistant chef, the chef, assistant. and you can get it also on the Lucky <laughs> on the Lucky Star, Star uh, mm -hmm. website. Mm -hmm. this, I'm gonna link you guys in the description, so just check that out. But to quickly run through the ingredients: spaghetti, obviously, some peppers. We're gonna be using the red pepper, mm -hmm. onions, uh, some cocktail tomatoes, mm -hmm. herbs, garlic flakes, tomato puree. Maybe it's onion, tomato puree. I was uh, now. I see, was now. You were already determined I don't know how to say it before I even say it. <laughs> some eggs, <laughs> some flour, some oil, and some black, black pepper. pepper. And obviously the lucky star of the show, some lucky star pelchers over here, guys. So what makes this video special, guys, now, is that we are collaborating with Ilaki Star. So Ilaki Star and Sushi Wasabi are giving away three cookware vouchers is a 6,000 rand. So basically you guys could win yourselves a voucher is 6,000 rand. And that is a lot. Exactly. If you guys just take pictures of your favorite Lucky Star meals, mm -hmm. like that remind you of home, that remind you of the taste mm -hmm. of home, and tag, take pictures of those, uh, of those meals and tag us, tag Lucky Star, mm -hmm. and we'll choose three Three of the best meals that we and see. And I know a lot of people that watch us cook. <laughs> exactly. So, yo, so take picture. pictures of your meals that you create with some Lucky Star pilchards mm -hmm. or Lucky Star chakalaka or anything mm -hmm. like that. And you could win yourself a voucher worth 6,000 rands and you can start your new year with some new cookware. Yay. So, guys, Yay. take if the pictures. I enter, I'll enter, but yeah. <laughs> take the pictures, hit us up, tag us, and you guys could really win. Okay, you tell us. So, what is the first thing that we're going to do? We're going to open without all these looking plastics. At, without looking at the recipe, since you said you're going to open, you're a chef. We're going to open all these plastics. No, mm -hmm. we need to open what we're going to use. Exactly. And then what is that? We're going to use all of them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So the first thing, then, yeah. because obviously we're reading from the recipe, mm. we're going to remove the poachers from, from the can. Okay. So what you're gonna do is open this. Okay, masters. You know, I'm used to having my mom out with uh, making the spaghetti and uh, mm -hmm. spaghetti and um, poachers meal. So I know how to open cans. You know, I'm used to these things. Okay. Let's see. Mm. Let's do. Imagine this is just the beginning. Ah, uh, Sasha! <laughs> this is a can opener. Obviously, you can open it. If I give you a knife right now, will you be able to open it? Sasha, these things, me, I know. Okay, remove it, guys. How to do these things, Sasha, yeah? <laughs> do, you, can, do you know how to do these things? Okay, uh, okay, then let me take a fork. Actually, like I said, this is legit one of my favorite meals, Sasha, so I know how to do this. Then. I know how to do it too. Both tins. Okay, I think we'll just do one for now. For now, okay. Because we're doing one. Okay, no stress. So when I when I speaking about the taste of home because basically this competition mm -hmm. is what um, 
is basically the competition is what reminds you of the taste of home. Mm -hmm. Where now it doesn't have to be a lucky style meal, mm -hmm. but what when I say the taste of home, mm -hmm. what food, what taste brings back memories of, of home? Of home. Definitely for me, mm -hmm. rice and chicken. Rice like and chicken. rice, normal rice. Mm. I don't even know normal rice, but rice yeah, yeah. and um, chicken, chicken stew, normal chicken tomato stew, the easiest chicken. That's stew. what you guys always eat at your house. That's like that's a main dish. That's a main dish. Like I, I think we can eat that from Monday to Friday. That okay. that reminds me. I'm sorry, but as soon as uh, Ilobola is paid out, ne, <laughs> and you're such a bunny, yeah. just please forget it, ne, because <laughs> me I don't eat rice. I know you don't eat rice. Yeah, I'm not a rice person. <laughs> I'm uh, so as soon as you know what they pay Sasha. Just know Oh it. yeah, but you also need to hear the things that I want nah, for you to nah, you nah. you're getting married to me so you have to eat rice not, at some point. Nah, you need really. to show that you know you love me, so you have to eat rice. I don't wanna do Yeah, but still how Nah you know, it's me. I'm, I'm We're rice. both getting married. Mm -hmm. Mina guys the taste of home for me. Mm-hmm. I love, I wouldn't mind from Monday to Sunday to oh, I know what the whole what's month your taste to eat it, pap. Yeah, that's pap good. and meat. Mostly pap and chicken, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. and then also spaghetti and Oh, also, tin fish. definitely also spaghetti. Or spaghetti and mince, you know. Yeah, I spaghetti just really and like mince. Sp spaghetti. Also, spaghetti and tin fish and spaghetti and mince is very easy to make and like you don't spend any time. So for me, definitely also. Exactly. And me, guys, in my house, my mom knows Wuti Papa. I genuinely am a huge fan of it. And it's funny because my mom is a uh, Kosa. So, Kosa people have a, a dislike, if I could say, a dislike mm -hmm. for I, I Papa. I don't know why Kosa yeah, people like Papa. Yeah, yes, I've heard, I've heard. Kosa people, if you can just give them mushu, if you can give them rice, if you can give them ama pants, especially the bride, mm -hmm. they are fine. They, they are mostly enemies, Papa. And my mom is closer, so you know, that means she must really love us at the house, eh? Shame, man. Eh? Does she like pop? Well, now she has two mm -hmm. because she's, she has no choice because the children love pop, you know? Does your sister like pop? Too much. So Are I you lying? Uh-uh. I don't think it. your sister loves pop the way does. you like pop. Pop is the greatest staple meal ever, guys. Trust me. I, oh. love, I love the spaghetti. Spaghetti is all, spaghetti also nice. Spaghetti is nice. With some peeled chicken or yeah. with some mince. Like I, I love stuff like that. I like simple things. You see, whenever I'm anywhere, if and I ever rice. move to America, mm. if I ever move to America for a couple of years, mm. I know Woody, as much as there's no, there's not really any pop there. Mm. If I would eat pop, I'd like instantly mm. miss home. Home, yes. yes. Okay, yes. Even pop, same. Mm. What, what, what am I opening right now? Okay, so. I've already separated the bones from this fish. Yeah, so that's the first step. You separate the bones yeah. from the fish. From the fish. And you lay out the pilchards on a plate, basically. On a plate, yeah. Okay. So. <laughs> okay, now um, I've taken out all the bones, ne? Yeah. And I put it in a big bowl because we're about to do the meatballs. So you've dried out the pilchards, separated the pilchards from the sauce. Mm -hmm, from and the put sauce. them in a separate bowl. Yes. Okay. So that we can make the meatballs. We're so going to take the pilchards mm -hmm. in the meatball. Well, the then... fish balls. Okay, yeah, fish bowls, yeah, mm. and then do this, yes, do the tortilla, tortilla, yeah. put it into bowls. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> so what we need to do is now season this, and then I'm going to put flour. Okay. You don't normally put, well, in the recipe it doesn't have flour. So, so why are you putting flour, Sasha? To, to, to make it stick together. Oh, yes. flour when makes when it you stick do, together. When you do meatballs or when you do burger patties, you have to put flour. So it sticks together yes. better. Better. Okay, I, yes, yes, I know mm. the technique. Okay. And then after that? And then after that, we're going to make a sauce, yeah. right? Yeah. With the remaining um, sauce that was left. From the pilchards. From the pilchards. And I use the same pilchard sauce. Yes, we're okay. going to use that. We're going to make a sauce with that. Okay. And then we're going to make the spaghetti. So okay. it's basically going to be a spaghetti, meatball. And saucy. And saucy kind of Okay. Parts. Yeah. Okay, no, no stress. So let's go. Let's go. So now we need to smash this thing. So in the recipe, it says there's a processor. We don't have a processor. We have oh. our hands. Okay. So we're gonna smash it with um, the fork. fork. Do okay. you wanna do it or you want me to do it? So we can do it together. So we're smashing it up right now. Yeah, well, I am smashing it up right now. Both of us, yeah. I'm helping too. How? <laughs> okay. This okay. is such an um, um, affordable meal, then. Yeah, it's such a student friendly. Like, I'll do this. 
So once we're done smashing up the, yeah. the meal, we uh, once, the, the pilchards, mm -hmm. we just make balls out of them. No, 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 no. Then we're going to season it. We're going to put all the mixed herbs. We're yeah. going to put the garlic flakes and the egg. Because egg actually makes everything stick together. But we're definitely also going to put just a little bit of flour just to make it stick properly. So on the flour bake, and no. then turn it into, into a fish cake. In 2021, eh? In 2021. Okay, okay seems good and crushed up now, Sasha. Yes, it's good and crushed up. I just mm. want to check. Okay, so now we're going to add um, seasoning. We're going to add the seasoning. Mm. So we can add first the one egg. Where's the egg? Eggs, okay. And the eggs. Do you know how to crack an egg? What, Sasha? Okay, shit. Where did you get these white eggs now? It has a, it's fine. It's I'm going to allow Sasha, you know, some moving now. Okay. Why don't we get a nice brown? Oh, it's the same thing. The way you crack that egg. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. People are going to tell you, you're going to get a little flick. I was going to get a little bit of 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 a little well, the taste of home for you guys at your it's house. It's garlic. Garlic and salt. and salt. We don't put too much. It's just that if if it doesn't smell like garlic, then I'm likely not going to eat it. That's why <laughs> every recipe that we do at Working Sushi with Wasabi always has garlic. Mm, I think we tried to bake a cake one time. Sasha was like, Oh hey, no, I didn't. We need garlic, babe. You like it. Hey, you like it. Not garlic on everything. No, okay, Sasha. You lying. <laughs> but I feel like it's not coming out. That's why I'm doing that. Oh, okay, now I see. Yo, but now my herbs are far cool, Sasha. Herbs um, don't kill you. I don't know what you herb, but they can kill you. <laughs> okay. Did you, and then, did you hear what I said? No. Did I just laugh? I said, <laughs> yeah, I'm, it, I do have to do puns these days because people record them and put them on Twitter. Yeah, guys. And it lets in, please, guys. I actually like that. <laughs> no, why? The, the puns are... Need to stay on whatever platform yeah, people say. Yeah, they stay on. Yeah. People must come here on YouTube Everything and watch the video. Then I say now, people are even when I'm on Instagram stories, people record and put it on Twitter. Okay, what I realized that it's yeah. it's very like sticky. Okay. That's the reason why I'm adding um flour. Oh. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of flour so that we can make them. So you're gonna make the meatballs. Okay. So basically, it says that it can be 16 to 20 meatballs. Balls, wow, fish balls. <laughs> so you're gonna hold it. When I want you to cook. Hey, I mean so I just watched in my mom. A little bit of me, you know. A little bit of me, a little bit of your mom. Okay, what did I learn from you? How to make big water. And that is a very valuable lesson, okay? <laughs> not many people know how to do that. <laughs> you know? Not many people know. And uh, not many people know, hey? Not many people know how to do that, guys. But this year, guys, I'm trying to cut down the quarters, you know? Mm. Trying to eat less quarters. Mm -hmm. I think December. Mm. I ate maybe a quarter almost every two days. Mm -hmm. So you know, when it was it was Christmas. Mm -hmm. Umnani, it was December. It was it was a pretty weird December, though, if I can be honest with you guys. It was Why a pretty was it weird... weird. Okay, so Mina, usually on December, guys, mm -hmm. my fa my whole family and I we drive down to where my uh, dad is from. Was, okay, we are we are Swati. My, my dad was Swati. My mom is Kosa. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't go to him Tata. Mm -hmm. Nope. The, where my mom is from him Tata, they still haven't built roads. So I'm not going there still. Mm -hmm. So I'm not going back there anytime soon. And I can cinema in Tata. So please. Anyway, guys. So my family and I usually go to uh, Malang mm -hmm. uh, during the December holidays. We always go to December holidays. Mm -hmm. But because of lockdown, mm -hmm. we couldn't go to um, Bumalam, obviously, lockdown mm -hmm. and traveling and this, um, you know, this thing we have, we're going through right now, mm -hmm. the P word, yeah, mm -hmm. the panoramic that we're going through right now. Mm -hmm. So it was a kind of a weird December, mm -hmm. spending it um, in Joburg and not going to Bumalam at all, even if it was just for a week. So one thing that was different around this time is that mm -hmm. instead of going to my aunt's place, because we, whenever we go to Bumalam, Babaton, uh, North Spread, would go to my aunt's house mm -hmm. but instead of uh, going to my aunt's house uh, to try and keep it uh, Decemberish, you know mm -hmm. to try and keep it Decemberish, mm -hmm. even through the stress of lockdown mm -hmm. we brought my aunt here instead of all of us traveling and that's, that's more dangerous it, yeah because yeah. my aunt was alone we just brought my aunt here and when you know it was December where we ate every day we cooked together mm -hmm. you know reminiscing in the kitchen eh? 
I'm going to go and I'm going to go into it. Stuff like that, basically. Mm-hmm. That's what we, we specifically compromise. A, a, a compromise December, basically. Yeah. Yeah. You know, Sasha, you should. When I'm she was always younger. Enjoying. But when you were young, I used to go to. Yeah, when I was young, I used to go to Mozambique. Mozambique, but yeah, she doesn't go there anymore. Now I don't really go there. Anymore. And it was bad. Really. When you go to Mozambique, I'm like. <laughs> A whole month. Yeah. And we don't see but I other. feel like my December has always been in my house. There's nothing yes, like that's that's how I see my Christmas. But I have, I have one problem with uh December, a couple Sasha guys. Um I don't know if you guys do this, but it's January right now, no? Here's my problem. It's January right now, guys, no? mm. So here's the thing, at Sasha's house guys, mm. they go big. Yeah, you know? we do. If they go big for Christmas. Yeah. They love Go it. big or go home. I don't know if, if they there's watch Christmas, there's Christmas. A lot of if Christmas there's movies. No Christmas, then there's no Christmas. I don't know if they watch a lot of Christmas movies at Sasha's house. There's no trying Christmas. Home Alone. Yeah. I don't know we what's just, going on. Definitely. But they have a tree. Yeah. They have presents underneath the tree. Definitely. They open the presents at night. Yeah. Around the People home. that follow me on Instagram know. Dinner table yeah. and everything like that. Dessert, everything. That's fine. You know, me and my problem is. I knew it. For my, what? The people don't want to know this. They, they don't, don't want to know this. The decorations. And they were three weeks into Janawa. <laughs> We are three weeks into January and there's still the Christmas tree up at Christmas Sasha's is a happy holiday. Yeah, but it ends in December. No, so we wanted to Christmas carry on is 11 months away. Until Feb, the first it's day. It's 11 thing. months away. It's 11 months away. Can you please take down the tree? I don't know. I think yes. something's wrong with you. Take why the tree. Why must we because take down the tree? In January. Why do you have a problem with it? Because we're in January. Christmas I, I am sure no one away. has a problem with it but you. Sasha, please take down the tree. At Eastgate, I still see tree. No, you lie. Eastgate, the 27th of December, they take down the decoration. Oh, no, they don't. On the 27th of December. No, I know the light because of the electricity, but the tree, the tree's still there. Oh, now I'm just preparing the meatballs. So you smart, what you do is you take the camera when we're about to do the meatballs so that you don't do the meatballs. No. Very smart. (laughs) Very smart, okay? So now let's see you making the meatballs. Okay, so we're gonna do this. So this is one of them. Mm-hmm. Or you round it into a baller. Yeah. Life is like a baller. Mm-hmm. What goes around comes around. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Life is like a baller. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. So put it in the flour. So what is the flour for? Wanted to make it stick just better. Just to make it stick better. Can you see it's better now? Okay. Okay, we're and just gonna place it there. You place it on the plate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Make another one. So basically, that's what we're doing right now. You could do the whole put um, egg thing and then put flour thing, but yeah. we already put egg, and yeah, it's not about the egg. It's about it's not, it's not about the size of the dog in the fight. Mm, it's about, about the, the size, size of the fight, of the in, the fight in the dog. So, so guys, we did say that we talk about where we've been, especially mm. in January, and why we hadn't uh, come back sooner. Mm. Well, the plan was always to come back in Feb or late March. I mean, your Feb late March. The plan was always coming back in uh, Feb or late January. Mm-hmm. But um, even if we did want to come back earlier in January, we couldn't because Sasha and basically her whole family yeah. actually um, um, got, the, um, got the girl. The vid. <laughs> Sasha was sick. The vid. <laughs> That's what the cool kids call it. The vid. The vid. You know, the, kid, the cool kids call uh, the vid. Hey. Sasha and the her f- whole family basically oh, got vid. sick. Yeah. We we in my house. We got it like, last year already mm-hmm. during the early stages of lockdown yeah. and re- recovered and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Our Sasha did not get the. Um, um yeah the, the, the virus until until this year and this year we really wanted to like not make anyone sick so we Basically. stayed home we didn't want no one like george would literally stand by the door there mm, by the gate the, yes and leave the the, the, the packages the Imagine. groceries by the gate and she'd fetch them yeah. so sasha was sick guys i haven't seen sasha for like two or three weeks yeah i'm only seeing sasha now when we record this video which is like three weeks later and like i've been getting people saying did you guys break up no guys i was sick <laughs> sasha was really sick was when, uh, sick. sasha's mom was really sick uh even the kids guys but yeah. they, they really recovered and i would bring groceries to the house bring uh, some medicine to the house i'm like hey stay stay there stay there you know and stuff like that Your and boyfriend she uh, sometimes I'd bring them takeaways but sometimes she, she'd have to cook and yeah. stuff like that. why do you cook really when you're sick what what chicken, chicken soup 
chicken soup. What? Chicken soup. In Italian, it's chicken gimbi. Eh? Chicken, chicken soup. Yeah. Yo, we love the chicken in my house, eh? <laughs> I think it's my mom. And I'm not really a fan of chicken like that, but because yeah. of my house. Yeah. Yeah, soup is a very big thing when you're sick, yeah. especially in my house. So chicken soup keep you guys going, basically. Definitely chicken soup. Yeah. yeah, it's the easiest thing to eat and easy to go down your throat when you're not feeling well. Basically. Mm. Yeah, guys, yo, it was, it was tough. Eh? I haven't seen Sasha for like three weeks and I was like, yo. <gasps> But yeah, no, they, they, they recovered guys, they yeah. medicated, they, they mm. basically locked themselves down in the house, no one came yeah, in, no, no one came, came out. out. The yeah. people that cooked, we had to cook. Yeah. I had to cook mostly because there were kids in the house also and... I'm so glad that you guys recovered though. Yeah, yeah. you did recover. I, you. Yeah, I think... Beautifully. Yeah. The tomatoes, um, the, the, cherry, the cherry tomatoes and stuff. Yeah. I don't think the tomatoes are supposed to fry for that long. Yeah. Then we're supposed to add the excess um, sauce, sauce, the poached sauce, and then the to tomato to puree. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, Shadow, look at them. Puree, babe. Are you puree? You puree? Let's add it. <laughs> okay. Into the sauce mixture. Yeah, we're gonna add it. Into and then the that's sauce. when what's gonna make our sauce. Yeah. We put that to the mm -hmm. spaghetti basically. Mm -hmm. okay. So come. Okay, so I've already added the excess chili um, sauce, sauce from, the from the pilchards. Now I'm adding the tomato. Puri. 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 <laughs> you see? This is one special recipe. Eh? Mix it too much. We mix it too much. Yeah, because the tomatoes are supposed to stay alive. Okay, so we're just mixing this, mm -hmm. but I must not mix it too much because mm -hmm. the tomatoes are supposed to stay alive. What does that even mean, Sasha? <laughs> They're supposed to you stay alive. You don't want them to. You don't want me to crush them. No, I don't want to. Basically, no. Oh, okay. Okay. What do we need? Oh. Yo, this sauce is looking thick, hey? Eh? Yeah, it's thick. But it smells good, yo. It smells really good. It smells amazing. Mm. Okay, so now I've mixed the sauce into the tomato and now we're going to add the spaghetti into the sauce mm -hmm. and then we're going to place our plate. So basically you're going to put... You're going to serve? Yeah, you're going to serve. We're going to serve with the meatballs on top. Okay. And so we're going to serve first the, the, the spaghetti, spaghetti and sauce and then, we put, and then put the meatballs, meatballs. on top. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's pretty cool. And we said good guys, we're going to talk about 2021, what we plan for the year and what mm -hmm. we're gonna do differently mm -hmm. i wanna generally release more content mm -hmm. uh on across all my channels like i've said this before i wanna record uh release on arcade for those who of you guys who have missed me on arcade i wanna release on my main channel and yeah i wanna also push sasha you know <laughs> i wanna push sasha you know because sometimes she feels like nah i don't think this content is gonna work out and that, that time the, the content is, is fire so I think that's one of those little things I need to do more, like um, motivate her to to record now. Yeah? To record mm. definitely. Because I'm sure you guys wanna see her do. Because she's very passionate about the fashion, the the fashion thing. So yeah. one of the challenges she actually meets is uh, maybe not trusting trusting the idea or trusting the execution. Yeah. And yeah. So I think I need to motivate her more this year. So she needs to drop more. more I think that's one of those little yeah. things. You know, as a as a as a partner or as a family member, you like to motivate you. You guys have your your own uh, relationships with your own people and how you motivate them and how do you basically get them through my challenges? Because this is gonna be a challenging year, guys. Hopefully, it is easier than last year, 2020, but it's gonna be a challenging year. So I think one of the things me and Sasha like to do is just motivate each other and yeah. tell each other that um, 
hey, everything's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be cool. Mm -hmm. Just uh, you know, that little motivation, that little push. Yeah, that little push. Because she definitely needs to drop more videos on her on her channel. Yes. At least one video per week, ne? Definitely. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. This sense. year, I really wanna focus also on Sasha Langa. Yeah. Mental health, definitely. Mm. But like, be me. Do yeah. what I wanna do. Like, yeah. not stop. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like you give me all the advice in the world and I never take it because I'm like scared. You don't trust me. I don't trust, trust it. Mm. But this year, I really want to do that. Like, I wanna push myself. I wanna push myself to be. The best session. Exactly. Yeah. What do you guys, what do you guys um, do to help your family members push through through some challenges or mm -hmm. your partners or stuff like that? How do you motivate them, guys? How do you motivate them? Like it's it's tough, you know. Mm -hmm. Some people. The reason I'm hoping to see more channels from you guys this year. Yeah. You know, uh, I know a lot of you are stagnant because you're like, ah, I don't have the right things and stuff. You know, I feel like a lot of it's, I saw a video that says a lot of YouTubers will just say, well, the equipment doesn't matter. When you actually, when they actually have all the equipment and stuff like that. Mm, but it didn't matter when we started. We didn't exactly. have anything. But we didn't get all this equipment when we started. We didn't mm. have it. it. It just builds up over time, guys. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's all about like just you know trusting yourself and trusting it and just you know pushing people or pushing yourself through the challenges that we are going to meet this year. Yeah. This looks amazing, babe. Yeah, wow. It does. This looks amazing. You yeah. guys want to see it? <laughs> Are you ready to taste the meal? I am ready to taste the meal. <sighs> okay, first let me taste the meat for you. Mm. 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 Obvious. Mm. Mm. That's nice. It's just that it's hot. Yeah. I forgot that it's um hot um, yeah. chili sauce. Mm, chili sauce. Ooh. So I always have to tell the normal This filters. is actually a meatball. Yeah. Inside, I don't think you're supposed to cook it for that long because yeah. it's soft inside. Well done to myself and thank you so much, Sasha, for helping me. Ah, ah, ah. This is an amazing meal. Yeah, Turned out amazing. Wow. Mm. Great meal. Anyway guys, like we said, um, follow us on Instagram on Usasha Not George and you'll see more details about the competition. Also on our personal Instagrams, Okay Wasabi, Sasha Sushi and go over to the Lucky Star Instagram page. You'll see more details about this competition too where you could win yourself a 6,000 Rand voucher. Mm -hmm. And basically, yeah, take pictures of those Lucky Star meals and show us what you guys can do. Mm -hmm. And yeah, tell us how that meal kept you going basically. How mm -hmm. that Lucky Star meal, why it's your favorite Lucky Star meal and how it's kept you going basically. But yeah, guys, this was delicious. This was great. Thank you so much, Sasha, for helping me. It wasn't Thank easy. You Keep so the much. cheese versus the Yeah, I was supposed to add cheese. It's finished it's now. It's finished, Sasha. I'll add when I'm eating. Yeah. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. We hope you enjoyed it so much. Like I said, I'll put the description. I'll put the link to the um, to the recipe in the description, mm -hmm. so you can follow it and cook it yourself if you want. Mm -hmm. And you'll see the ingredients there too. Mm -hmm. But yeah, from Sasha and I. Thank you so much for watching. My name has been Okay Wasabi from Fosora Sports 75. The world is getting me this night. I'm explaining the glass is too close to run to all. Touch the sky. I wasn't alone. I was actually with the most beautiful woman in the world. Sasha AK. Sushi from your boy Africa Unite. The top chef. Come taste this thing because I can and see you want to taste it. Come. Yeah. Come taste it. Because I can see you want to taste it. You've been looking. Upachi. Yeah, yeah. Upachi. The foot of the Vaseline. Got to swim. But feed, the thing is, him. I can't, yeah, I'm gonna feed him. I'm not gonna give him the meatballs because it's very hot. Mm. It's Do you eat hot things? It's chilly. Mm -mm. Don't really eat them. But how was that? Mm. Nice. Nice, yeah? Say, it's nice in the camera. Mm. 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 <laughs> Shut, guys. <laughs> Bye.